What's up everyone, this is Brian C and let's get started. So today we are going to be reviewing a special strap for my DSLR cameras. Now, I actually did a POV street photography a while back and one thing I noticed is the strap won't do, which is an amateur mistake of mine. And I can't just be using this type of strap that may actually snap off at any moment. So I decided to actually buy one of the cheapest that I can find in Amazon and see if it's going to work out. Now let's go ahead and open this baby up. Oops. There we go. And this cost me about $12, I think, $15, give or take. And looks like uh, it's actually not that bad here. It actually comes with a special packaging, <laughs> clear plastic and it is a JJC brand. Okay, so let's open this baby up, shall we? Okay, so what the heck is this? Wow. I have no clue what this is. Oh, uh, silica gel. So this is for uh, water absorption or moisture absorption. So for this one here, it doesn't look that bad um, so it's a wrist strap made made in China ST1 and it's made of soft material and looks like there's a lock here so how does this work so we're gonna be doing some testing here almost right away but first things first oh <laughs> I was actually expecting it to just rip up, but they set it up that way. Now we're gonna t use uh, my 7-7D here. Um, let's see, how does this work? Hmm. Okay, gonna need the tool for this. Okay, so the material itself is actually not that bad, the main handle. There's some adjuster here, which is actually quite nice, but this piece here is actually getting in the way. It's a solid plastic piece, and, uh, hmm. Not bad at all, not bad. But the most important part that I want to do right now is actually get this installed, and I'll be honest, it's easier said than done here. Doesn't actually give you an instruction manual, but it shall be pretty basic. How to do this. Okay, so one thing, one issue that I got right away here is just trying to install this okay yeah, there we go hmm <laughs> okay Wow, it's not an easy installation, but this is as cheap as I can get here. So as you guys can see, it's actually solid, solid piece here. So this is heavy enough. Not bad at all, not bad. Okay, so. Okay, so if I accidentally uh, ended up dropping it, it won't fall off compared to this one here, which is a Sony strap. And uh, I think this is from uh, an older HX80 of mine. This one, <laughs> Got a high possibility of uh, snapping off compared to the uh, JJC uh, uh, wrist strap for your DSLR camera. 
Now is this actually uh, worth getting? I would actually say a yes because the material itself is actually not that bad. Okay, so leather strap and you can actually take this off easily anytime. So if you're actually just putting it in your backpack. Now, of course you get to, if you're gonna remove this, just remember it will take a little bit of time to put it back in place. It's actually got some really nice, good material. I'm definitely gonna be using this for a while. I'm looking forward to it. So now I can actually avoid accidentally dropping it and uh, costing me thousands of dollars. For about uh, $12, $15, the JJC uh, wrist strap, I can definitely suggest. Now that's all the time that I got guys. Thank you guys for watching this video. Remember have fun, relax and enjoy and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.